Hi there guys, this is just a, a really quick video really, um, just concerning some uh, breaking news which is just over the sort of past hour, um, come out from Lucas Radovich, you can already tell from the title. Um, I'm just going to read out the statement before I go on to say anything else, but basically he is heading a consortium uh, which are hoping to, to buy a stake in the club. Uh, so I will just read out the statement that is on Lucas Radovich's website. Um, it says... A uh, statement regarding Leeds United acquisition. Following recent speculation, I can confirm that I am part of a consortium which has submitted a preliminary, in preliminary indication of interest regarding the acquisition of a stake in Leeds United Football Club. We hope to continue our recent discussions confidentially with the current shareholders and the board. We would like the opportunity to explain both the substance of our proposal and our strategy for working with GFH Capital to continue the rebuilding process at the club. So obviously they're wanting to keep GFH um, with the club which I think would be a fantastic idea. Leeds United has a special place in my heart. Ever since I retired, I, ha I have been considering ways to get involved at the club. Working at board level with an equity interest would be the pinnacle. It is my dream scenario. I would not have become involved if I didn't think our consortium would be able to help give the club a chance to go back to the Premier League where it belongs and to keep it there. I am hopeful we can find a way forward and make progress. So that's a statement from uh, Radby, and that's uh, that can be found on his website. I'll put a link to that um, in the uh, in the information below. So fantastic news! I mean, uh, you know, everyone knows uh, that the, the chief is an absolute legend at the club. You know, no one has a bad word to say about him, um, and you know, really, he's one of the greatest players that, that's ever played for the club. Um, and I think everyone's always really wanted him to, to get back involved with the club, you know, like he says there, he's always wanted a way of doing it. But I don't think anyone ever thought it would be in this way. Um, so it's a bit surprising to a few, but obviously it's something he has a has a big interest in, uh, saying it's sort of the pinnacle way of him getting back, um, back to the club. Just a few other um, uh, quotes to go with it. Um, Adam Pope from uh, Radio Leeds. Um, sent out a few tweets a while ago saying that Leeds United have told BC Leeds, uh, BC Radio Leeds that no further talks have been held with the UK based consortium um, which on Saturday offered around £7 million for a majority stake um, so when the last talks were made we, we don't really know there uh, and then a bit of news on the other people involved in the consortium, it is UK based um, and have made a majority stake bid for the club and it's believed to involve someone called Gary Verity, uh, Frank Devoy and Mike Farnan. Uh, apparently Frank Devoy and Ma Mike Farnan work together um, and also Radio Leeds understands that Gary Verity had tickets for the game uh, against Middlesbrough on Saturday uh, in the boardroom and that apparently those have been withdrawn. So I don't really know what that means or if to read too much into that, whether it's a good or a bad sign, um, nobody really knows. So that's things really as they stand. But like I say, I mean, it would be a fantastic thing to happen to the club, you know, to get someone involved who, who loves the club as much as Lucas Radby. And just hoping that the other guys involved in the consortium, you know, are people that are uh, sort of trustworthy and can, like he says, sort of give us a, a lot more financial funding and carry on the rebuilding process that you know GFH have done a decent job of uh, you know rebuilding the club uh, we seem a, a lot better off than what we were sort of 12 months ago um, but yeah it would be a fantastic step forward to getting back to the Premier League um, so it's it's one of these sort of watch, watch this space kind of thing uh, there's not, nothing really much else to add uh, but I'd like to know your views uh, guys I'm sure it will be met with a, a lot of positive comments but if people think you know maybe ex people involved in the club shouldn't sort of get back like this uh, then you know let us know uh, you can do this either in the comments below as always or at my twitter at chris jones lusc so uh, thank you very much for watching guys and uh, i will catch you later